Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm going to do my June favorites. I know it's like the second week of July, but I've been really busy lately and that's why I haven't posted any videos, so I apologize, but now I'm going to take the time to make one for you lovelies. <laughs> so let's get started. So the perfume I've been loving and that I got like mid-June um, and and I absolutely love it. I'm wearing it today as well. And it and it's the Daisy Marc Jacobs um, perfume in this packaging. I don't know what it is. I think it's one of the Daisy ones. Um, it is limited edition, so I apologize for showing you this. But I had to get this because of the smell. And the packaging is super cute. Like, look at this. It's so pretty. And it's so girly too. And it's like a fresh scent it does not last long um as much as my other perfumes but this is a go i love this scent um it just smells fresh and florally and girly and all that scents i can describe it to you um but yeah i love this and then the rest of my products are makeup related products because um i haven't been using any other um different products but some of them are new some of them are um oldie but a goodie so it's in this like little pink bag <laughs> um and yeah i'll show you so the first thing i'm going to show you are these two foundation together so this is the Rimmel wake me up foundation and this is the revlon photo ready foundation this was a tad bit too dark for me in june because i haven't been tanning um so I added the photo ready and it looked like a face glow madness and I freaking love this together. So um, this is the darkest shade they have and this is in natural beige number 400. I got the darkest shade because I felt like the other ones are going to be too light for me. So um, yeah, they don't have a good range of color selection for Rimmel but I love this and then so I just combined it together it has the same effect to it so that's why I um, paired it together so that is that and then the other face product I've been using and this is an oldie but a goodie this is the dream Lumi touch highlighting concealer from Maybelline mine's like all jacked up and my batteries are gonna die so yeah I'm gonna do this a little bit quicker Sorry, and like I gotta go, I gotta run too. But I got it in Radiance. So this is what it is. It just highlights. I put this as a V shape under my eyes and it just brightens up my eyes. I love this. Anything that brightens up my eyes, love. Okay, so the next product is this primer, and I'm actually wearing this today as well. And this is the, whoa. And this is the Too Faced Primer and Poreless, which looks like this. Um, I love this stuff because it smooths out my foundation and it makes my foundation glide on so, so well. Um, so, yeah, I've been venturing out on primers this year, so I just love it. It is a little bit pricey, but it is worth it. Um, the next product is this concealer. Look at the packaging. It's so cute. Like... How can you not pass that up? And this is the Benefit Fake Up Concealer. What it is, is mine's all jacked up so you can't really see. But the middle part is the concealer and the outer part is moistur the moisturizer. And I have like really dry under eyes. So this helps helped me um, moisturize my eyes. And it concealed very well. So yeah, I really love this. Okay, and then the next product is this eye palette right here, and this is a limited edition. This is an oldie but a goodie as well, um, so I apologize for showing you this. This is the Kat Von D um, palette in Memento Mori, and it looks like this. It's very summery, it's very colorful too, which I like. Um, I just love this palette. Um, very versatile. I did use a lot of nudes. And the pink as well so and the blue is really nice too so yeah I've been using this non-stop that, that past month and the next 
product is this blusher and it's the Wonder Woman blusher in Mighty Unfraid. So it's a duo blusher. So it's a darker side and a lighter side here. And I absolutely love this. I've been using this a lot and it gives me a nice glow as well. I love blushes that already gives me a nice glow so I don't I can skip the luminizer. But I still put luminizer because I love me some glow. <laughs> so yeah, I love that. And then the other blusher that I've been loving is NARS um, Cactus Flower, which looks like this, and it's a cream blush. And oh my gosh, everybody and everybody should own this blusher. It's like amazing. It looks good on every skin tone, especially on fair skin tones. Oh my god. Like, wow. It is really, really pretty. It is pricey because it is NARS, but it is worth money if I had one NARS blush it would be this one so yeah love this blusher the other blusher that I've been loving is this one is the ombre blusher from MAC and this is Analyze, Analasia um, Blossom it's a, a pink to purple um, ombre which is amazing I really like this this gives me a nice pink glow to my um, pink glow pink cheeks to my cheeks if you know what, what I'm saying <laughs> but I just love it and it's I just love it it's a really nice color and a nice blush um, and it's not too harsh too which is good okay and then the next thing is another face product and this is Maybelline's Fit Me um, powder. I've been using this with the um, foundation that I've been loving. Um, as you can see, I hit pan and I just love this um, powder. It just gives me a nice uh, finish glow to it as well because this is more of a satin, satiny finish. And I'm in number 320 so I've been loving this in June. So the bronzer that I've been loving is this bronzer. This is the Sunny Bronzer from NYC. And you should all know what this looks like. And this cost me like nothing, like three bucks here. So it is worth the money. Um, and I haven't hit pan. This gives me a good long way, I must say. It like lasts forever because you need, all you need for this one is a light tan. Absolutely. Because or else you're going to have like a muddy contour. I always contour with that. And then the next thing is two highlighting products that I've been loving. The first one isn't actually a highlighter, but it's a baked blush from e.l.f. And this is in Pinktastic. I use this as a highlight because it gives me a nice glow to it. This is too light for me as a blusher, but as a highlight, this is like amazing. It gives me a nice glow. Anything with glow, it's just amazing during the summertime. And then this one is e.l.f. Blusher. But this is a highlighter in Gotta Glow. It's just a white highlighter. And I just love it. I just love it. Okay, so the next couple thing is um, some lip products. Oh, an eyeliner. Ha! Huh. This eyeliner right here I've been loving on my wa waterline. And this is Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Underground. It's just basically like a brown um, pencil. I've been loving brown on my waterline because it's not too harsh as a black during the summertime. Um, you can absolutely use this on your upper lash line or waterline as well. <laughs> and yeah, I just love this. Okay, so the next couple things are the um, two lipsticks I've been like absolutely wearing constantly. Um, the past month and the first one I'm going to show you it is limited edition and this is from the the recent collection with the brown packaging um, and this is Feel My Pulse and it's a purple color which is amazing I wore this a lot and I love it with or without lip gloss usually I wear it without lip gloss because it gives me a nice sheen already and yeah I just love this color so that's that and then the next one is two pairings, and as you can see, it's going to be an orange color. This is the Vivid 
Vivid um, uh, line from Maybelline, and this is number 885 uh, Vibrant Mandarin. It's a bright ass orange, which looks like this, and I love this color. This is amazing. Um, during the summertime as well, I'm gonna get lots of use out of this actually during the summer. I actually recently bought another orange one from this collection from this line, so I'm excited to use that one. And then I pair it with um, number 40 Captivating Coral. This is one of the Maybelline um, High Shine lip glosses. And I love their this lip glosses. I own two already and this is like my third one. I want all the colors, no joke. I just love it. And it's drugstore too. If you're looking for a good drugstore um, lip gloss, try out the Maybellines if you see if you like it. I just love it. It moisturizes my lips and it gives me a nice glossy look. Um, it gives me a nice finish. So, yeah, I've been really, really loving that with pairing it with those two together. And then the last two products are nail polish and it's these two right here. So I'm going to show you this one. This is my first L'Oreal nail polish and this is the L'Oreal um, color in the orange number 410 it's a nice summer orange color don't mind my nails I'm gonna get them done soon um, and yeah I just love it I have these on my toes right now and it's amazing um, and the formulas of L'Oreal's is amazing so yeah I just love that and then the next thing is I've been wearing this on my nails because it is a nude color and this is spiritual um, nail polish in La Dilac. I don't know how to say that but it's this nice nude pink color I just love it on my nails okay Wow. Well, that is my June favorites. I hope you enjoy. And yeah, you should tell me what you like in the month of June. <laughs> and, and just comment below or post a video or whatever. I love watching monthly favorites um, at the end of the month. This is like my go thing, my go to thing. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoy and I'll for sure definitely see you in my next. Bye.